subscribe to RA Solutions by clicking on the subscribe button and clicking on the bell icon to receive notifications. Hello there, welcome to another video by RA Solutions. What I'm going to be doing in this video is showing you how to convert um, your text or anything in bullet points into smart art to make your PowerPoint presentation more eye-catching and engaging for the audience. So what I've got here is a PowerPoint presentation with three slides. My first slide is a title slide which says RA Solutions. My second slide which says hardware and it's got five different pieces of hardware there in a bullet pointed list. And the third slide is software with five pieces of software there. So what I'm going to do for the purpose of this video is show you how to convert my bullet pointed list into smart art. Okay, so before I continue, please, I would like you to um, like this video, subscribe to my channel and click on that bell icon to receive notifications. So I'm on my second slide here and I want to convert this bullet pointed list into smart art. Now, let me show you what I'm going to do. So first and foremost, what I'm going to do is highlight all the text in the bullet point, right click on my mouse um, button, then scroll down to where it says convert to smart art. Now, what you can see here is some options. And if I hover over some, you can see already that information is being converted into particular types of smart art so what I'm going to do is choose one for the purpose of this video and then um, show you what I can do um, as a step forward so I'm going to choose this vertical picture accent list here so that's my smart art now it looks a bit you know it's, it looks better than the original bullet pointed list but what I'm going to do is add some color to that um, smart art list there so at the top here you got the different smart art styles you can see you can change the style okay to the one you want if you can see that uh, you can have a 3d one here but I'm gonna keep it to the first one here okay you can even expand it by clicking on more by choosing more smart art options there so I'm just gonna leave it like this but I'm gonna go to the change color option here so choose my color palette and then choose a colorful um, or you can choose any from this specific list here um, to the one you really like so I'm going to choose this first one here because that's colorful now what I'm going to do you can, you've got an option here to change to choose pictures so here you got one for keyboard click on this picture icon here and you can choose from different options there okay so you can choose or add a picture from a file from stock images from online pictures from icons I'm going to choose icons here click on icon then I'm going to choose an icon for my first um, hardware which was keyboard so I'm going to type in keyboard in there okay and it's going to bring back different types of keyboard I'm going to choose that one there and click on insert okay so obviously now it's replaced that obviously default picture icon with a keyboard icon there you do the same for this one go to icons to mouse and um, I'm going to choose this one here click on insert at the bottom and you can see the pictures change now to that one click on this picture here click on um, this one's going to be printer click on insert same again monitor and you can see all of a sudden by a few simple clicks you can see my um, my PowerPoint presentation is a lot better than the original um, bullet pointed list microphone now I'm gonna put that in choose a my I like this one here click on insert there so you can see all of a sudden my PowerPoint present presentation is a lot more eye-catching than it was previously you can do the same here with hardware highlight the hardware click on bold you can change the color of the font here to make it stand out so it's not the default you know color uh, as it was originally um, but you can see all of a sudden there is a noticeable difference and my PowerPoint presentation is a lot more eye-catching than it was originally so let me do this one more time uh, let me do it on this one here software so what I'm going to do is highlight the text in the bullet pointed uh, sorry highlight the all the text in the bullet points there then right click on your mouse go to convert to smart art 
choose the smart art you want. So let me choose a different type one, um, different type this time. Um, let me choose one. Let me choose this one here. Then from here, let me click on the picture icon for word processor. And obviously this is going to be quite hard. So word processor, you could do writing on word processing. So I'm going to choose one for writing here. Uh, let me choose that. There you go. Click on this picture icon here and do a search for database. So it might not bring anything back, but I like this one here, this disk icon. Oh, actually, I saw something better, but I'll leave that one. Spreadsheets. Choose that one because it's a table. This one for presentation. Choose a different one. Let's choose. I have an idea. Um, that one looks like a presentation to me. There we go. Uh, let me choose this one for web. That's going to be interesting. Let's do www or maybe internet or maybe computer because we're searching on a computer there we go that's a good one there now what we need to do is make this colorful so it's a lot better than it was before so I highlight this smart art here remember you can change the style of that smart art here from the top that one's pretty good there then you click on the color palette or to change the colors oh, that looks pretty good and then what we can do is also change the style and color of the title as well there. So there we have it. So this is a quick and easy video showing you how to convert a bullet pointed list into smart art. I've shown you how to do it for one specific style of smart art and a, another specific style of smart art. I've also shown you how to add your own specific icons in there to customize it to what your PowerPoint presentation is about. So this way it makes your PowerPoint presentation more engaging, more eye-catching um, and obviously whatever you are going to be articulate, articulating in your PowerPoint presentation you will hopefully um, be able to capture um, the audience's attention with the colorful nature of your PowerPoint presentation. I hope this video has helped you understand how to convert text, simple looking text into smart art. Please like, subscribe and share.